Why are you recording? I'm actually the imposter. <laughs> this review should have just taken a couple of weeks to do. Instead, it's taken me a whole eight months. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, the Keeping Bear, and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm reviewing the Mailing 12. So before we get out of the way, this is a pretty standard review. The only real puzzle I have this to compare to is the Shangshao Pillowed 12x12, which I don't have in my possession. So I will not be comparing this to any other puzzle. I'll just be comparing it as a 12x12. This cube comes in at $119 on Speed Cube Shop, but right now they're currently out of stock. So if you guys really, really want to get this puzzle, I recommend you go to the cubicle.us where you can get this puzzle for $124.99. On there we got this cube in stickerless it's 93 millimeters and weighs 504 grams so it is quite a hefty puzzle but i don't think the weight is actually that bad all things considered it's actually lighter than my 11 by 11 magnetized so that goes to show you that uh it's not that heavy but it's not it's not as heavy as you would think it would be right, let's actually get over to what this puzzle actually has this puzzle is a very big but yet small puzzle it's a 12 by 12 that can be held in my hands and you know cubing has gone quite a ways since I'd say I'd started cubing. Back then, a 12x12 12 12 would have been the size of probably a basketball. But now we have them relatively the size of basically a notebook or something like that. This cube is very, very smooth and turns very, very well. The only thing that I would say that you should watch out for is that it can pop sometimes. I actually managed to get a pop on camera, and here it is right now. So you can see um, I was turning the cube, and then I realized something was off. I turned the puzzle around, and it turns out that it was actually popped. So what I decided to go ahead and do was I just decided to go ahead and um, keep solving without i just started, i just decided to go ahead and keep solving without it so that's that the shades on this puzzle look absolutely incredible you know you can't go wrong with these shades they're very well made um they have the same mofang jiaoshi color scheme that we have seen from the 2x2 all the way up to the 11 by 11 so it's got fluid reds it got it's got vibrant reds it's got very nice blues and very good oranges greens and whites and yellows all that good stuff we've come to expect from mofang jiaoshi oh, the only real gripe i have with this puzzle is not really any gripe at all it's a great cube it's a 12 by 12 that can fit in your hands that you can solve wherever you want it's perfect for those long road trips perfect for those times you just need you know some time if you're just spending some time alone and you just need to pass by the time you can go ahead and grab your 12 by 12 and just start cranking at it this, this is a pretty short review i don't really have that much to say other than that it's a great cube um for the price um considering that the other 12 by 12 from Shangshao is $200 and this is only $119, I'll go ahead and recommend this, not only because it's squared, but also because it's a, it's actually a better feel in my opinion. It's 12 by 12, I don't really know what else to say. You know, it's great, go buy it. If you guys want a 12 by 12, go ahead and get this one. I recommend it over the Shangshao I do. If you guys can, I totally recommend that you guys go ahead and try to magnetize this cube. Um, I probably will magnetize it. Let me know in the comments if you guys want me to magnetize this cube, um, but yeah. That's all I have to say about this cube. Um, it's really great and um, hope you guys are doing well in this time of heat and all this other stuff. I got a couple of unboxings coming soon. I just have to wait on one item. I have all the other things ready to unbox. I just have them stored away in my closet right now, but I need this one more item for me to unbox the whole thing. So you guys are gonna have to wait on that. I'm sorry about that. If you guys like this review, be sure to give it a like, make sure to hit the subscribe button, turn on post notifications. Let me know in the comments what you think about this cube and I'll see you on the next video. It's a Cuban Brown. Thank <laughs> you.